What your favorite trend says about you, part two, travel levels. You have too much free time as these levels take way too long to play. Levolution levels. You do not have a good PC and you love it when critters actually care about the object limit. Low object levels. You either run Geometry Dash on a potato, or you love to see just how creative people can get with their object use. Hell levels. You have multiple demons inside you, and these levels are the only ones that can understand what you're going through. Boss fight levels. You love fighting games and needed some good action from the simple cube game. Glow levels. You find that just a pinch of glow doesn't quite cut it when it comes to making a level look good. Effect layouts. You love feeling like there are no rules when you play this game. Classic auto levels. You miss the old days when creators made their own unique auto gameplay. Modernistic levels. You are a minimalist and love good color combinations. Good thing these levels aren't the hardest ones to make. Giga collab levels. You wish you could have made a part in one of these levels along with all the other more famous people in them. Secret way levels. You can't be bothered to actually play a full level. There has to be some skip in it to be fun. Generic levels. You are more basic than even me. Temple levels. Your favorite game is probably Ocarina of Time, and that's pretty fair. Challenge levels. You think 100,000 attempts on a level isn't actually that much. Element or alphabet levels. You remember the days when Geometry Dash forms were still active. Technology levels. The only reason you like these is because Flaroni taught you how to build them. No clip levels. You want to feel like you can actually play this game.